Hey everybody, happy new year. It's Saturday, but I wanted to pop in and start my weekly what I wore vlog on a Saturday because, well, for two reasons. First of all, I am wearing a fun sweatshirt today because my sister is coming over and we are gonna watch the Harry Potter reunion. <laughs> so I'm wearing my Hufflepuff sweatshirt that I got at Universal Studios a few years ago. I had to take the quiz before my daughter would allow me to purchase a sweatshirt. She said I had to know which house I belong to and I'm a Hufflepuff. So if any of you have taken the quiz, I would love to know what house you belong to. And so I also wanted to share with you the disarray that my house is right now. My husband, every once in a while, gets on this like kick of wanting to redecorate the entire house. So um, I guess change is good, <laughs> but that means my house is an absolute disaster right now. There's the um, kitchen, there are books everywhere. So we had very tall bookshelves right here and we emptied them completely out. They had plants in them and now the plants are on them to stay away from the cats, but they were filled with books and just some sort of like um, little decor things, sand that I've collected at beaches, just, you know, little knickknacks. So we have sort of, decided to switch things around a bit and then so we have our tv here and then we put two, a bookcase on either side we're going to fill those with books and then i don't know what we're going to do <laughs> we have this great big open space that when we first bought our house it was like very choppy so we had like a wall here a wall here a wall here and it was an you know an older house that's how they built them but we just when we renovated it we opened the entire thing up and then we put this wall up so it sort of closed things up again and we really missed that like open feeling so we're trying to get that back a little bit and in the process we are taking everything apart so that was our new year's eve that's what we did for new year's eve my husband and i managed to stay up till midnight but it was because we were taking all these books off the shelves and moving furniture so you know you're in your 40s when <laughs> anyway guys i am off to have some breakfast and wait for my sister to get here so we can watch some harry potter i hope you all had the best new year's eve and i will see you tomorrow all right everybody it's monday first monday of the new year it's gonna be a good one i feel like this monday is gonna set the tone for all the mondays of the year we're gonna be positive <laughs> so looking forward to today and starting the new year off right i hope you all had a great weekend we didn't do a whole lot around here we well we did do a whole lot but it was all in the house sort of reorganizing getting everything picked up we made a huge donation yesterday um, of stuff that we did not need anymore and that felt really good so after that we went to the mall and just kind of walked around we didn't buy anything but we just had fun just kind of going to the mall getting out of the house I feel like that's such an important thing this time of year I have not gotten out of the house enough and I told my husband yesterday that needs to happen more I get into a funk for sure this time of year and I need to <laughs> work on getting outside even if it's just to go somewhere that's also inside but just getting out of the house is really important so all right here's what I'm wearing for the first Monday of the new year this sweater is by evolution by Cyrus I've worn it lots of times I got it in a stitch fix box last year and I love it it is um, very chilly here this morning so last I checked about an hour ago it was about 18 degrees but it's very windy outside and with the wind chill it feels like it's seven degrees so it's really cool this sweater is very warm <laughs> so that's what i'm going with today i'm going to be nice and toasty i am wearing my black jeggings by mud and then these boots are from kohl's mm, several years ago they're light lighter brown but with like darker brown accents and i think they're really fun and just kind of a a good sort of earthy tone to go with this sort of more rust slash brick colored sweater i'm not even sure what color you'd call this sweater but i love it it's got like these little bobbles all over it and all over the arms so cute so much fun and this turtleneck which i think i would call it a turtleneck is definitely far enough away from my neck that it's not constricting in any way which i absolutely love because it's still warm but not constricting and then i just have my gold dangle earrings that i love and that's my full outfit i should probably back up <laughs> so you can see the whole thing so here we go i'll do a spin and that's monday all right guys let's go start the year off great i will see you tomorrow hey friends happy tuesday monday is over and i will say it wasn't a bad one so i'm hoping that that is setting the tone for the rest of the mondays for the rest of the year it was a busy day but people were in good moods everyone was seemingly you know pretty happy so that makes me happy and makes me think we're off to a great start. So 
Today is Tuesday. I am working tonight, so I'm wearing a comfy outfit. I'm also taking down the Christmas tree in our children's room today, so I know I'm going to be moving a lot. I just need to be comfortable. I need to wear shoes that are comfortable and just know that I can move freely and take off a cardigan if I need to. So this outfit is definitely a comfy outfit. This dress, I have several of these dresses from Old Navy. I'm going to take the cardigan off so you can kind of see the actual silhouette of the dress. This one kind of maybe reads a little bit more fall, but that's okay. I don't really care about that. <laughs> So this one, I love these dresses because I feel like they're pretty slimming, but also hide everything. So I'm going to do a little bit of a side turn here so you can see. These are just sort of swing dresses, and usually they're fairly cheap at Old Navy, like $15, $20. So I'm wearing this one with navy blue leggings and some darker brown boots. I just think those tones all go really nicely together. And then I am also pairing this today with this cardigan by Letty and Me, which is sort of like the sage green color that I think matches well with the leaves in this dress. So I'm just wearing this at least to start because I know it's very chilly out this morning. It was about nine degrees when I took the dog out, but there was a wind chill of some kind. It was pretty chilly out there. And she was very interested in some kind of animal poop that some other animal <laughs> left there. So she just wanted to stay outside and sniff everything in the area. And I was very cold. So anyway, it's definitely a cardigan kind of day. I know I just said the other day that I haven't been wearing as many cardigans, but I don't know. <laughs> I guess I am. <laughs> so anyway, I'm gonna back up. Make sure I don't have any kitties behind me, but here is the whole outfit just for my comfy Tuesday. So I am off to go film a video for you guys. I'm gonna do sort of a reveal of the change in our living room. We did a lot of work on New Year's Eve. So I'm gonna sort of film a video on getting rid of things and how to best do that and show you sort of a before and after of our living room shelving units and all that. So, all right guys, thanks for watching today and I will see you tomorrow. Hey friends, it's Wednesday. Today is a story time day. And when I first saw this dress, I knew it would be perfect for story time. This dress came from a fashion box. It's by Aria. It's A-R-Y-E-H. I'm not sure I'm pronouncing that right, but I'm calling it Aria. It's this bright red that would have been great for Christmas too, but I got it sort of right at the end of the season. So I did not wear it at Christmas time at all, but I love this dress for many reasons. One, look at these pockets. They're huge. I don't think I would put anything in them except my hands, but they're huge, which is really fun. It's also one of those dresses that's super comfortable, super flowy. I can move so easily in it and it's just bright and fun. So just kind of the perfect, look for story time so that I can, you know, move easily and also sort of be an attractive color, I guess, <laughs> for kids to look at. I don't know if that makes any sense, but you know what I mean, kind of. So I've paired this dress with black leggings and black boots that I don't know if you can tell because they're black on black, but it's sort of like not quite, they're not to my knee, they're sort of like above the calf. And then I've also put on this black necklace. I can't remember where I got this necklace. I've had it for a really long time, maybe maybe Kohl's a long, long time ago, like years ago. But I like that it's a little bit sort of bigger and kind of breaks up all the red in this dress just a little bit. So for earrings, I just have in little studs here because I didn't want to be overwhelming with the earrings and the necklace. So I think I forgot to spin again. So here's the back of this dress. It doesn't really flare out when it spins and that's totally okay but it's just a really really fun look for story time and I'm really loving the color it's just it's brightening up this very overcast winter morning so guys I hope you're having a great week so far we're already to the midway point which is amazing this week is flying makes me so happy I will see you tomorrow Good morning, everybody. It is Thursday. We are getting so close to the end of the week. I have to say, this is my first full week in a couple of weeks because we had Christmas and then New Year's Eve. And then I realized I was sort of like going through my calendar, figuring out our vacations and what's going on the next few months. I'm only working like four full weeks <laughs> in the next three months because of vacations. I did go about a year without a vacation at all. So I really kind of have been saving up my time to be able to do this. So I'm very excited to not have to work that many full weeks in the next few months. It just makes me very happy. So anyway, let me share with you what I'm wearing today. This dress is by Lily Rose. I wore one just like it last week it was more of like a houndstooth pattern and this one is much more romantic and floral this one is by lily rose i got it from kohl's and it's a tiered baby doll dress it's hard to see the tears because of sort of the coloring of this one but it's got this um under layer here that's 
like a solid black and then it's very sheer the top and the arms obviously you can see are very very sheer as well so I'm gonna back up so you can see the whole thing I'm wearing this one with black leggings and shorter black booties that are also from Kohl's so really this whole outfit is from Kohl's not the leggings <laughs> they're from Walmart I need to find inexpensive leggings like these ones that I bought at Walmart a couple of years ago they're starting to get a little bit pilly I'm starting to worry that they're not going to last much longer and I got these for like I don't know five or six dollars from Walmart I got three pairs in solid black but I don't see them anymore I have to go back and look again I've looked several times but it seems like they've switched over from that softer knit to just something that's a little more kind of starchy I don't know if that's the right word but it's not comfortable feeling so I'm kind of sad about that and I'm looking to find something that's inexpensive but also nice and soft and comfortable sort of like that LuLaRoe leggings feel you know like that butter soft and Walmart used to sell them so I have to be on the lookout and see what I can find if you guys have any suggestions please feel free to share them in the comments below all right guys I am heading off to work in my little dress I'm gonna do another story time today I hope you guys are having a great day and I will see you tomorrow hey guys happy Friday I am just popping in really fast to say hi because it is snowing like crazy outside and I need to get to work early I need to actually leave early so I can get to work on time hopefully the roads look terrible out there so <sighs> looking forward to a nice snowy ride <laughs> anyway what I'm really nervous about is that my son has to drive to work in this too and he's a much less experienced driver than I am obviously so anyway just really quickly I'll show you what I'm wearing this um, cardigan is by Love Ellie it's very bright yellow with white stripes I'm wearing a white t-shirt kind of thing with these like flutter sleeves from Old Navy under it and it's super comfortable so I have a music and movement program today I'm not sure it's actually gonna happen because if I were a mom of young kids I would not want to take them out in this weather so we'll have to see we don't usually cancel programs unless the library is closed and the library is not closed so anyway here's the rest of what I'm wearing I have on dark jeans by Wallflower and then these boots are from Kohl's they're just dark dark brown boots <laughs> that I got a couple of years ago all right guys I am out the door I will see you guys next week thank you as always for watching bye